Parents, students and staff are in shock tonight after a prominent Greensboro school closed without warning. The only notice about the closure at American Hebrew Academy came this morning in an email. Tonight we spoke to the athletic director who's worked at the academy for nearly 20 years. He told WFMY News 2's Laura Brache the closure is surprising and traumatic. It was a family affair for Phil Papier. He was the athletic director there since the school first opened its doors. His wife worked there and their son graduated from there in 2017. Papier says that some faculty members knew the school was struggling financially as fundraising efforts and donations weren't the same as in the beginning. Now he and his colleagues are left wondering what's next now that this big chapter in their lives has probably ended. We were kind of, in, kind of in denial that this day would, would ever come, but um, you know we're still hope, holding out hope that someone's going to write a big check and they're going to say, just kidding, we're going to open again in September. Uh, but uh, at the same time, I think we're going to have to go in and prepare for the worst. I spoke off camera with other staff members who say the timing was just really bad. Some of them have kids on the way or are in the midst of becoming homeowners. Pat Pierce's son was a new basketball and soccer coach there. He knows his situation isn't as bad as other more established employees. I have a support system here, but a lot of other people are, are the providers for their families and they're going to have to start figuring out how they're going to, you know, move on with their lives. The Papiers told me that AHA, as they call it, will always be home to them and that they know alumni and longtime staff will always make sure the legacy of the prestigious boarding school lives on. And it's important to understand how abruptly this all happened. Papier told me, told me, excuse me, that just a few weeks ago, new faculty members were hired. We're still trying to figure out what happened exactly and how it ended all so abruptly. We'll be keeping you updated.